Spear, spear, spear. Not quite the gore, 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 but it was a spear for Braun Breaker. He speared Dragonov in half to retain his NXT Championship at Halloween Havoc. Now, I don't know if I am mispronouncing Dragnevov, but you know what? I don't really care. The guy fucking sucks. So I am going to continue to mispronounce his name. Look, this main event, it was okay. I'm not going to sit here and say it was garbage. I'm not going to sit here and say it was horrible. But at the end of the day, it, it, I mean, it was a bit boring. It was just move after move after move. Just just wrestlers doing moves. And I know it's a wrestling match. I, I totally get that, 100%. But how can anyone be a fan of this dragon off guy? No character. He literally just wears trunks and does a move, followed by another move. Followed by another move. Strike, strike, strike. Wrestling move. Strike, strike, strike. This guy is... You know, there's thousands of guys like him. I just I just don't get it. Anyway, him and his shitty wee trunks looked like he was about to win. But it was kind of predictable because he was beating the shitty Braun Breaker. And then he goes for his running knee, but Breaker doesn't even give him time to attempt it. And he just cuts him in half with a spear. So yeah, Braun Breaker wins. Braun Breaker retains his title, but I felt like it was a bit predictable. It's kind of the same thing with Mandy Rose. Look, I am all for Mandy Rose and Braun Breaker being the champs. I have said that when you look at Braun Breaker and Mandy Rose, they do look like the two champions. They do look like the two people that should have the belt. You know, you've got Braun Breaker, the big guy, athletic guy, powerful guy, looks like a stud, looks like he could be on the posters for WrestleMania. You know, he, he looks like someone you could build a company around. Dragnevov and JD McDonald ain't that. All right, Mandy Rose, hot fucking chick. Fucking sexy bitch, right? Looks like someone that should hold the women's title. And she's solid in the ring. That doesn't really matter, but it helps, okay? It helps. Mandy Rose, Braun Breaker. Definitely two people that you could see, you know, main event in Raw, being big deals in Raw and SmackDown, big deals on the main brand. But I think their title runs are just getting... You know, a bit too predictable, a bit too boring, and a bit too long. And I've got to wonder, how long will it be until they're called up to the main roster? But look, that's it. I will save all that stuff for the review. But Braun Breaker has won the title threat match, and he leaves Halloween Havoc with the championship intact.